parents of Jennifer Cussworth today thank the media for their efforts in keeping their daughter's story in the headlines, thank the police investigators for their efforts, and also expressed sorrow for the family of Neil Snelson, who's accused of killing their daughter Jennifer 16 years ago. The emotion-filled event concluded with reporters being handed a carnation, their daughter's favorite flower. The people of Kelowna have been behind this case since day one. The incredible support that has been out there for us has been overwhelming. Even from strangers, the number of tips that come in after a media session, the, the hugs and words, kind words we get from total strangers when we're out on the street. Thank you, Kelowna. Thank you for supporting this, this walk that we've been on and being there with us. There are, I guess, somebody asked yesterday, um, are we excited about this? That's not the word. We are, there's a feeling of relief that we finally come to this point in the journey. We know we have further to go, and it's going to be a long, hard road, but there's, there's relief that we're here. Now we wondered uh, when we started uh, how far it would go. Would it just stay in Kelowna? Would we lose it somewhere down the line? But it's gone a lot further than we ever thought it would, a lot further. And as Jeannie said, so many people to thank you guys, the police especially, with with a, a couple of prods in the beginning. <laughs> we, we were very frustrated when it first happened because we wanted it to be solved in the first 48 hours, 72 hours, if you wish. Never was, of course, but uh, the police have stuck with us over the years, given as much information to us as they possibly could have, and as much information uh, as we asked for without prejudicing what was going to happen in the future. It's been an ongoing process, but we will see it through. However it plays a little ways down the line in court and such until it's finished. Mm -hmm. And I also had a question about uh, one reporter asked me, uh, is this the last time that you're going to be laying flowers out there? No, no. We'll be doing that until the day we die. In, in memory of our daughter, forever, basically. Yeah. I guess my hope is that if he's found guilty and he has admitted to the truth, he has told the truth, that he can learn to move on with his life. We don't want another life lost through this. We don't. I, I, yeah, I think Jeannie's saying we don't want, we don't want any more victims other, other than Jen, who was the original victim in this. Well, we don't want any more victims. Well, we don't want his life lost either because of what's happened. Mm -hmm. If he can mm -hmm. admit to it, and, or won't admit to it, tell the truth about what happened. We don't know what happened. A lot of people have asked, have we forgiven him? Um, we can't even think about something like that unless we know what really happened. But it's not our forgiveness he needs anyway. It's its own if he's going to move on with his life. They have to now walk the path that we have walked for 16 years. They have to go through this no matter whether, whether they get hounded by, by people or, or kids at school or such and such. I hope that doesn't happen. I seriously do. But for them, it's with them now for the rest of their lives. We have a message for the man who's been arrested for her murder. What happened 16 years ago changed our lives forever. Didn't destroy our lives, but it's changed our lives for e forever. 20 years from now, something can trigger that pain and knock us to our knees. A flip of a hair, a song on the radio. We know that. Uh, it's part of our life now. What happened 16 years ago also changed his life forever. We can't bring Jen back. He can't bring Jen back. It's not going to go away. That's a message I want to get to him. This is not going to go away. We won't let it go away. It's time, Neil, to, to share the truth, to talk about what happened that, that night, to do that for yourself, for your family, and especially for Jen. You owe her that much.